Hello, everybody. Um, my name is Tiffany, for those that don't know, and I work in influencer marketing. So it's interesting. I don't consider myself to be an influencer. I would say more so I'm an influencer of influencers. So I work with influencers to partner with brands and create content and promote you know, the messaging of various brands. So I don't normally do this, but I felt like given influencer marketing is my space, uh, I should probably do a little bit of influencer marketing of my own, uh, even though it's for products that I'm not being paid to endorse in any kind of way. So backstory, um, I'm usually not into things that get promoted on Instagram. Like, you know, whatever the latest trend is on Instagram, I'm just like, um, if there's like 20 celebrities endorsing it, I don't usually think that's authentic or valid. So I won't, you know, engage, participate, and usually just ignore whatever the product is. Because, I mean, like, take the Kardashians. They promote everything from, like, waist trainers to diet pills to hair pills to, like, whatever. So I, I just don't believe in any of it unless I'm actually seeing them regularly utilizing the product and whatever. And usually it's not the case. So uh, my real hair, this is not my real hair, although it looks very nice, uh, courtesy of my hairstylist. Um... My real hair is actually similar in color, um, but it's about, or it was, this much in length. So I, it was probably my fault, but I got my hair dyed, and then I didn't wait long enough to get a keratin treatment. I got the keratin treatment too soon, and as a result, my hair started breaking off. So to save it, protect it, had to put a weave in. It's fine. I'm used to wearing weaves. I like them, but I was really enjoying the last year and a half of not having any weaves in and really, you know, just maintaining and taking care of my natural hair. So when this happened, I was like, oh my God, what am I going to do? And luckily one of my friends, Anastasia, she said, you need to try sugar bear hair pills. And I was like, what? Is that one of those things that was like promoted on Instagram? She's like, yes, but she had heard it was recommended by other people as well, like some credible people that she knows recommended it to her she's used it and now because of it even her hairstylist and her nail technician have been recommending these sugar bear hair pills uh to take so i'm desperate a little bit because if anybody knows black women our hair is really our crowning glory so for me to have my hair breaking off in huge clumps was like horrifying i'm actually surprised i didn't cry like i totally maintained my composure uh, despite seeing this much hair coming out of my head. Uh, so I finally got the Sugar Bear Hair Pills. I ordered them. I decided uh, to do a six-month trial. Uh, I just didn't think one month of taking pills would be enough, and they did have a three-month uh, package. But since it was on sale, I decided to do the six-month package, and it was cool. It came pretty quickly, two-day priority mail. So I'm going to open it up with you guys uh, to see what's inside. I know I, I kind of know what to expect in the kit. Um, it should have not only the pills, but like they gave them like a cute carrying case or something along those lines. Uh, credit to them for making this so hard to open. Uh, <laughs> but they wanted to make sure it was secure and I got everything that I paid for. So shout out to y'all for that. Let's see, is it enough to open it yet? Of course it isn't. Okay, let's keep going with the tape around the edges. Um, I don't remember the price off of the top of my head, and I'm sure the price constantly changes, but for me, I just felt like the six-month uh, kit was worth the cost um, versus buying individual bottles. And like I said, just trying it for a couple months and not... Um, I, just, I was trying it for like a month or two, just wasn't going to be enough time. So here it is, opening it up, it's nice, I kind of messed up the blue paper, but you know, they definitely wrapped it nicely. Uh, so let's see what's in here. Uh, alright, so it should be six bottles of the Sugar Bear Hair Vitamin Pills. Oh, this is cute, they put a little Sugar Bear keychain, as well as some, uh, Sugar Bear stickers. <laughs> Not really sure what I will use these stickers for, but okay, it's cute. Um, let's see. Ah, interesting. Okay, so here's a carrying bag. 
the carrying case has three of the bottles in it. Um, that's cute. I like that. I, I definitely love the color. I'm a Tar Heel fan, so. Um, here's the actual bottle of the Sugar Bear hair pills. Like I said, there's uh, three in the carrying case and then three more in the box. And then they also gave me a brush included with the kit. But, uh, you know, brushing your hair actually causes a lot of damage to it. So, look. <laughs> luckily, I, I can brush the weed, but I won't be brushing my actual hair for a while. Um, the interesting thing when I did the research about these pills was the fact that um, they're vegan. I was really surprised by that. And they have a lot of vitamins that you can naturally get in fruits and vegetables. So it's not like it's unnatural products. Um, and I, I, everything I read online in terms of the reviews, people say, were saying that they tasted great. Uh, so let's see. So today is January 6th, day one for me. And I'm going to open and try two of the pills now. And we'll see how this goes. I mean, I'm I'm really am hoping for a miracle because, like I said, the experience of having your hair break off um, is traumatizing. <laughs> I think for anybody, uh, but black women especially, because you know we, like I said, it's my crowning glory. Um, I'd work really hard, and my stylist is really good in helping to maintain it, keep it natural. Like I don't have any relaxers. Yes, I do get keratin treatments once or twice a year. But keratin is actually supposed to be good for you. So who knew that it could actually break your hair off if done too closely to when you've gotten it dyed. So first I will say, as soon as I open and take the seal off, they smell really, really good. Like, they smell so delicious. Like, I could see somebody wanting to eat the entire jar like it's candy because they really do smell that good. So you're supposed to take uh, two a day. Chew thoroughly before swallowing. Do not exceed recommended dose. So don't have the entire bottle. Um, but yeah, they make it very clear they are vegetarian gummies. Gluten-free, soy-free, cruelty-free. <laughs> Who could you harm in making a gummy? Um, let's taste it. Yeah, you know, it's, it's delicious. <laughs> I could totally see why someone would try to eat the entire bottle. It is delicious. The little bears are kind of cute, too. Um, but, yeah, so I'm excited. This is day one. I'm going to try and be good and check back in. Um, probably probably 60 days. Um, but it will see because that's the other thing. Like, I want to see if, if it really does get my hair to grow faster. It'll mean that I'll have to take my weave out sooner. Normally, I keep weaves in for six to eight weeks. Um, but if the pills are really working I might have to switch it out in four to six weeks so the next time that I actually take the weave out I will check back in and do a progress report on how it's going with the breakage and the growth but uh yeah sugar bear hair pills let's see how this goes talk to you guys later